Okay, that's it. Okay, now to take the A arms off, which are these right here, we're gonna have to get inside here, okay? Inside the screws, so there you go. All right. Okay, now we're going to be able to take the body off, but whoops, I just realized I have one more screw to do. Now this screw I'm doing on the far, far end of the camera is tricky because I think pieces will fall out. It's a really big screw that holds multiple things together, which I'm taking out right now. So... You just want to be careful with this one. Okay. See how long it is? Okay. There's, what I was talking about is right there. It houses this the steering con steering module and stuff right there. There we go. Okay, now it should be able to slip apart. Take it with the pieces that came with it. Oh, what? I'm gonna break my camera. Okay. Now, what you see here is is the rods right there, right there, that how that hold the A arm together, and we're gonna be taking that out right now and it's very simple and yet again I don't have the tool for it. I'll be right back. Okay. You don't, for those of you you think will damage the rod, it won't. So all you do is grab a hold of it and pull it right out. And there's actually two rods connecting inside, and it's not all one. So then, you take, well, you get the point. You just take the two rods out on this side, lay them where you won't lose them. Ah, there we go. Oh, there goes the one A-arm. Huh. There we go. Okay. Now we disassembled the A-arms. And I'm not gonna show you how to do the bottom A arms because because as you can see they are the exact same thing there is the pins to take them out so it's just the same thing nothing new 
Okay, I only have a little bit left of this video. Now, what else to take out? And let's see. Um. Okay. Let's see what else now. Next. I only have three minutes left, but oh well. So that was how to take the shock, the front shocks off, the A arms, and the spring rods or whatever you call them. So, yep.